Hi, my name is Taylor Hill. I'm here with another Power Business Minute. And today I'm going to talk about one of my pet peeves. Yes, I do have them. So I may, I may rail a little bit, get up on my soapbox, but I promise afterwards I will gently step down and get back off. So here it is. I hate when somebody tells me that they hate employees or employees suck or there's no such thing as a good employee, or employees are the bane of my existence, or for any of that stuff. Because let me tell you something, guys. If you think that, who wants to work for you? Because your mindset is already in a negative place. You don't like them, they know it. When, when you sit across from them in an interview, they know you don't like them. They know you really don't want them. And guess what? Why would they want to work for you? So the first thing you have to do is make sure your mindset is really a positive, affirmative mindset when you start hiring people. You know, and yes, you may have a bad experience, but if you have a bad experience, it's because you did not hire intentionally, you did not hire well, and that's your fault. That's not the employee's fault, that's your fault. If somebody steals from you, you didn't hire the right person. If somebody's late all the time, you didn't hire the right person. You guys gotta hire the right person. When you hire the right people, employees are a joy. They're a godsend. They are the ones that help you build your company to a place that you can't do by yourself. You need these people. They are fantastic assets, but you have to think about them correctly before you ever, ever sit down and have an interview or go hire another person. Just remember that. It's up to you. Have a great mindset about your next employee and watch how that changes your business and your world. See you next week with another Power Business Minute.